I'm on G Herbo Story, so he definitely knows I'm there. He definitely knows, baby. And so do the little boy who posted it. Mm-hmm. Yes. Very much. Very much. Now, what we don't know is that you exist. <laughs> Welcome to Reality TV. A Bureau of Little Women Atlanta calls out G Herbo and another rapper named Lil G Slim for laughing at people with dwarfism. Here's what happened. Lil G Slim posted a picture of a bureau with some guy on Instagram with a lot of laughing emojis as the caption. G Herbo dropped some laughing emojis in the comments along with Lil G Slim's fans. A beer of fans tagged her in the comments of the post and she wanted to know what was so funny about the picture. Before we get into this video, make sure you like this video, comment, and subscribe if you're new to the channel. Now check this out. Like G Herbo. I feel like you're you're you should be you should be not being in there. You know what I mean? You shouldn't be in there. And then for you to share and to say, oh, man, I miss my nigga. Okay, you miss your nigga and you promoting music. At me. At me. Because let me see that it's being funny. You used a picture that was being, that was, you used a picture that was to be funny. It wasn't like you posted this nigga by himself. You posted the picture of me and him being funny. You thought it was funny. Like, oh, man, my nigga used to have a good time. Ha, 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 I miss him. Stop playing with me. Y'all finna stop playing with me. Yes, please, ho, remove yourself immediately. So that's all I'm saying is don't. And if it's not, baby, you shouldn't be over here. If it's not that deep to you, you shouldn't be over here. You should go where you belong. Period. Yes. It was low and childish. Absolutely. And it was intentional. Right. Don't announce it. Just go. But she also wants some clout. That's why she's over here. Right. If it was innocent, why why the fuck was it all laughing emojis? Tell me. If it was innocent, expeditiously, immediately, out it. And it's your mama tea for me too. Bye, bitch. Y'all know I'm on one this morning. Y'all can't tell people how to um feel. Y'all can't tell people how to act. Y'all can't tell people how to respond. No, y'all can't. Right. Thank you, Winter Hill. Just because he famous don't mean he can't be held accountable. First of all, no, I'm still peaceful, but this is like, okay, so when a reporter sees the news, right, it's their job to report on it. So with my normalized dwarfism campaign, it's my job to report it. It's my job to speak on it. And that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to speak on it. Did people telling me the man in the picture, um... Or the person that posted it, they don't even know saying that he passed away. That little boy, that boy ain't passed away. It was his father, God bless the dead, who has passed away. Which, that's not his daddy in the picture. So... 
So that's all I'm trying to say is don't try to come on my post and tell me how to feel. I've been dealing with this shit my whole life. I know when somebody trying to be funny. Y'all think I don't, I don't know when somebody trying to be funny. This is something I deal with every day still. This is something my daughter will deal with every day of her life. Child, please. Listen, children. Y'all got to go get some cereal, please. Go get some cereal and get off of, get off of my page. Go get some cereal and get off my page, little kids. Phoebe and Jahirin are eating cereal. Y'all go join them. All I'm saying is this. I don't get what's funny. And if you miss somebody, you could have used a whole different picture to miss somebody. You ain't how to use a picture that was used to be funny. I just, I felt like I needed to, oh Lord, this, the, the fake page, child, come on fake page, you want to be blocked so bad, now you block us, by fake page. This is what I'm saying though, everybody want to be treated equal, everybody want to be loved, everybody want to be this. Do y'all know that it's a 50-50 chance for every human to have a person, a child with dwarfism? And it comes, the mutation comes from the male. Did y'all even know? So, bitch, you and your lady can have a little person baby next year. You keep talking, you just might. What you gonna do then? What you gonna do then? Oh, you gonna recant. It ain't gonna be funny no more. When a bitch laugh at your baby, you gonna be ready to fight. Good morning, Tay. You're going to be ready to fight if a bitch laugh at your baby. But because you don't have, it's not, it's not hitting home for you, it's not funny. I mean, it's, it, you don't care. It's funny. Until your baby mama push out a baby that's a little person. Or your child push out a baby that's a little person. Now you a grandpa of a little person. What you going to do then? What you going to do then? They can call me Jamie Foxx. Matter of fact, at Jamie Foxx. Add him, please, because I'm trying to work with him for Vonda. Y'all add him. Instead of calling me Jamie Foxx, add his ass in this bitch. Please. Please and thank you. It's not about him saying anything bad. It's about him laughing and then using the picture that was he thought was funny, because I don't get what the fuck was funny, to try to memorize or say that he missed the man that was in the picture, sweetie. That's the thing. And if y'all don't like what I'm saying, y'all can kindly remove yourself. Because that's y'all also a part of the problem. Ignorant, dumbasses. That's what y'all are. Because like I just said, if anyone, if anyone um, of y'all had a child with dwarfism and somebody was laughing at them, y'all would be upset as well. Y'all would be offended as well. Oh, okay. No, now one of y'all can tell me how to feel, how to be upset, how to post, what to do. Nobody in here can say that. Because guess what? If you had a little person child, you wouldn't, you wouldn't go say, oh my God, you offended me. No, bitch, you a snap, crackle, pop. Period. So stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. As if, oh no, he wasn't saying nothing funny about you. Well, what the fuck was he saying? What the fuck he was saying then? Y'all better wake up and smell the fucking Folgers. What was he saying? The person that posted it was being funny. All he posted was nothing but laughing emojis. Then G Herbo in the comments saying, stupid man. Ha 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 ha. What's stupid? And what's funny? 
I'm going to tell you what's stupid and what's funny. Because he posted the picture being funny. He was like, oh, like if we were sitting and having a conversation and somebody told you, oh, man, look at that person with dwarfism. Or like y'all like to say, look at that midget. Ha, 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 ha. And his response was, man, you stupid. Ha, 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 ha. Bitch, that's offensive. Y'all so fucking lame. Y'all like the dick ride. I ain't dick ride. I don't give a fuck. But I did tell him, go ahead and send me a beat so I can show him what's really funny. So I can show him what's really funny on how I kill a beat. Any beat he on, he can break, send it to me so I can kill it. Period. Easy. This man got millions of followers and he thinking it's funny. Baby, your baby just a little baby. God forbid you don't know what could happen in the next six months. You don't know what could happen. Listen, I, I tell people all the time, look, don't do that. Don't laugh. Don't do that. We humans, so when we see something different, you know, we're curious. But it's time to stop that. Like, y'all want to sit here and tell me this man wasn't being funny. What the fuck he was being then? He damn sure wasn't being positive. What he was being... He wasn't being positive. He was definitely being funny. He was definitely adding on to the joke that was already posted. Really, Sabrina? The dude who posted it was really being funny. What he was being? No, y'all just dick riding. Don't dick ride over here. Go ride his dick on his page. Period. Go do that. Go ride his dick over there. It don't matter. And so maybe that's the problem. The same people who get bashed all the time on social media, y'all run them off of social media. But you won't run a beer off this bitch. You won't run a beer off this bitch. No, I'm not talking about no damn bump man. I'm not talking about nobody off, this, off that damn show. You won't run a beer off this bitch. That's the problem with society. They think, oh, it's social media. You know how many kids and how many people that killed themselves from being bullied on social media? You won't bully me, though. I'm going to talk my shit and I'm going to talk it loud and proud. We talking about the boy who posted the picture and we talking about G Herbert. We talking about two folk, two people. See, y'all don't want to talk about that. Y'all think because it's social media. Social media is, is, is what? It's like the new newspaper. It's like the new news of, of this century, of this time. You know how many people take social media serious? Listen, bitch, anytime and bitch post anything about me, if I see it, it's on site. It's on site, bitch. I'm going to address it. I'm going to address it. And I don't care. I'm going to address it every time, anytime. And I don't care who like it and who don't like it. Don't post me being funny, bitch. Don't post me being funny if you don't want me to say nothing. And they need to know to stand up for people too. They need to know too. They need to know too. They need to know that they mama don't play and they don't need to play with a bitch either. Period. You don't keep shit quiet, honey. You don't keep it quiet, boo. That's the problem, everybody. Y'all want to humiliate a person in, up in, in, in out loud or make fun of a person out loud. But then when a person reacts, oh, my God, don't do that. Oh, my God, the children. Oh, my God, this. No. No, because what if 20 years from now this resurfaces and my child has to see their mama being made fun of? No, stand up for what the fuck you know. I don't know. No, I think the boy who posted it, dad is dead. Not the man in the picture. 
Not the man in the picture. I think the person who posted it, his father is passed away. Well, I don't know. Don't make me lie. Anyways, you shouldn't have posted it. You shouldn't have posted it. It don't matter. It don't matter. Rip, rest in peace to whoever's dead. But you shouldn't have posted it. They do know I exist, bitch, because I'm on his story. I'm on G Herbo's story, so he definitely knows I'm there. He definitely knows, baby. And so do the little boy who posted it. Mm-hmm. Yes. Very much. Very much. Now, what we don't know is that you exist. <laughs> That's what we don't know. And that's all we want him to do. I hope he did delete it. Because that's all we need. Don't make fun of me because I'm not the bitch to make fun of. Somebody else may let you make fun of them. But bitch, don't make fun of me. I'm not one. Bitch, I'm, I'm, not, the, I'm not the one or the two. I don't know. Baby, <laughs> who are you talking to? I was going to take off. Uh oh. That's all I'm just trying to say. Please pay attention. Because just like y'all stick up for everybody else, y'all got to stick up with pe for people with dwarfism. Because everybody want to troll Lil Nas. Me personally, hey, I like Lil Nas. Why I like Lil Nas? Because he living in his truth. And he don't care what nobody got to say. So, and when a bitch got something to say, he right snapping, snap, crack, or pop at they ass. Period. Y'all want to say, oh, about the children. What he said, bitch, I ain't, I ain't no role model. I ain't y'all children parents. Huh? What? Huh? What? It's the same thing. Who you on the phone with? Honey. About my life? Yeah. <laughs> but yes, no. Yeah. Girl, I, don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't like that. I don't like that. I'm sorry, y'all. I don't like it. And it's cold. That's why I went outside, but it's too cold in here. But I don't like that. I do not like that because in my mind, I feel like we are living in a time where people are supposed to be treated equal. Y'all still think little people are funny? What the fuck is funny? Tell me what's funny. Because our heartbeat the same. Our motherfucking blood run the same. We fuck the same. We have kids the same. Everything is the motherfucking same. So what's funny, sweetie? Who is there? Tell me who there. The man in the picture? Can y'all tell me who did? So we can say rest in peace. Oh, I know you don't think so, but he definitely was. He was being funny. That's why he was laughing in the comments, boo. Okay, so, all right, the dude in the picture is dead. God bless his soul, right? But he's not the one who posted it. So we're not even talking about him. We're not talking about the man in the picture. We're talking about the motherfucker that posted and the motherfucker that has a platform laughing under it. Then reposted it in his story. So we're not we're not talking about that. That's not what we're talking about. We're not talking about the person that's in the picture. God bless his soul, the person in his picture. Because actually he's a victim in this as well. Okay, so Jehovah posted to his story like saying that he missed the man. What I'm saying is you ain't got no other pictures of the man for you to say that when you just was laughing on the comments. And then in, in, in the top of the picture, it says 2006 KOD was fun, 2016 with the laughing emojis from what the boy posted. No, I need to see the other people who, want, who don't have a platform. Nobody listens to them because they don't have a platform. It's the people who have a platform that people listen to. So those are the people that I need to be worried about. 
That's why you got shit fucked up and backwards at, baby. That's the people who I should be worried about. The ones that has the platform. Not the ones that's not on the platform. Nobody's going to listen to them. Duh. The fuck? No, I don't look like a goat. I am the goat, bitch. I am the goat, bitch. Don't forget it, bitch. <laughs> Don't forget it. Don't you forget it. What I don't like, though, is that people, this is my whole, if I, I wouldn't be true to my campaign, I wouldn't be true to normalized dwarfism do, if I don't say nothing, if I don't worry about it. What kind of fucking campaign am I running? I wouldn't, I wouldn't be motherfucking saying no, what normalized dwarfism, y'all think that shit just for TV? Oh, baby, that shit ain't just for TV at all. That shit gets down no matter what. He sure could have. That's what I think y'all got shit fucked up. Is y'all think I do shit for TV? No, baby. No, baby. Everything ain't real over here. It's normalized dwarfism. Yes. And it don't matter. A bitch ain't gonna fucking talk shit, use my picture as a joke. None of that. It's, it's, it's top of the morning, okay? It's top of the morning. I woke up, and I seen all my fans adding me on this picture. Then I went and looked and seen that everybody think it's funny. And it's okay. But then it's not okay, because then I wouldn't be normalized dwarfism. They have a right to their opinion, and I have a right to speak about it. Okay? They have a right to their opinion, and I have a right to speak on what I want to speak on. And this morning, I chose to speak on that. And if you don't like it, you can simply get the fuck off this live, block me, unfollow all of the above. Right, it's always... Y'all always think that. That's what y'all think. Y'all think that it's about nothing. And that's why people feel some type of way. That's why people be insecure. That's why people don't want to live in their truth. Because the ignorant ass people like y'all in my comments saying, I'm making it too much of a big deal. No, fuck that. Bitch, I'm not a joke. Never been and never will be. Thank you. If the man in the picture is dead, what's the point? What's the point? If the man in the picture is dead, what did you post it for? You ain't say real. You just put out. So you laughing at a dead man and a little person. Even worse. How does it affect me, bitch? The picture is me. That's how the fuck it affects me, dummy. The picture is me. I'm in the picture. Hmm. Hmm. Hello? So now you done posted somebody who dead and a little person with all laughing emojis. So which one funny, that the man dead or that I'm in a picture? So now it makes it even worse. Now it makes it even worse, y'all. I'm just trying to figure it out. And I don't even know who the man is in the picture. Who is the man in the picture? Do y'all know who that man is in the picture? Because I don't even know him. Do y'all know the man in the picture? Because I don't even know the man in the picture. I, I mean, I, obviously, that's my ass in the picture. But... Baby, it's 9.25 in the morning. They probably coked up and doped up. 
So they can't respond yet, baby. <laughs> they, they can't respond. But it's not them responding. I don't need a response from them. I need to stand up for my folk. What is that? The pool key in your room. No. Yes. Jasper had the pool key the whole time. Whole time. Put it in the drawer. And also, guess what? What? So when I was downstairs with Jasper, you know the Santa Claus here in high school? Yeah, they're in his room. I already know. I actually found one. No. no you Whatever. Both of them. Back up, Jasper. I don't even do that. Back that ass up. One. Both of them. Phoebe, go in there. Back it up, Jasper. Go and finish. All I'm saying is this. Baby, what I need is to let my people know and educate people on dwarfism to normalize it. That's what I need. I need to get on here. I need to post. I need to respond so I can normalize my people about dwarfism. And that's what the fuck you're experiencing right now, sweetie. Sweetie. Anything else you got eyes? That's the problem. See, the problem is y'all don't like people to stand up for themselves, but y'all always saying, oh, yeah. No. Oh, yeah. We, we agree with equal, equality and, and equalizing people. and Y'all don't agree with that shit. Y'all don't agree with that shit. Y'all don't agree with that. Right. It's absolutely. It wouldn't still be bad. If he was, a, if he was, if I was a normal sized dancer, he would have posted that picture like, oh, this bitch so fine. It would have been so much, even though I know I'm fine. I don't need a bitch to tell me I'm fine, bitch. Four kids looking fantastic. Fair motherfucking tastic. You hear me? Fair motherfucking tastic. You hear me? Fair motherfucking tastic. You hear me? Oh, okay. So I, I don't, I don't, I don't motherfucking need a bitch to say that I'm fine. Good job, Pooh. But what I'm saying is, he they posted that shit. First of all, that's not even him in the picture. That's number one. That's what y'all need to realize. The person that posted it, that's not even him in the picture. Okay. But, like I said, I only got on here because I see people... You know what I'm saying? Thinking that it's some on some other shit. No, baby, it's about educating. This is my campaign, Normalized Dwarfism, sweetie. So, sweetie, and I'm going to do it every time, anytime, all the time. And I don't give a fuck what nobody got to say about it. I don't care if you like it or you don't like it. I'm going to speak on myself. I'm going to speak, especially if I'm in the picture. Especially if it's me. The dude who posted that, that's not him. The dude who page that is, that's a young man with dreads. Your charger's in my room on my bed. Say hey to the people. That's one of the people I do it for. That's one of the people I do it for. She has dwarfism just like her mama. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like this video. Comment down below and subscribe if you're new here. Until then.